What's going on guys? My name is Supakoto Dan and I'm back today with the Skyrim VR tutorial. I'm going to tell you everything you need to know on how to play Skyrim in VR, virtual reality, for under $40. Uh, not counting that you already own the game. This is PC only. So console guys, sorry I can't help you out. I think Bethesda has done enough of that already with giving you guys a little taste of the uh, Master Race mods uh, that are all over the Nexus but besides the point today I'm gonna be showing you how for under forty dollars or actually thirty bucks thirty bucks you can play Skyrim in virtual reality now this virtual reality works with first person games the best I will be honest about that but you can pretty much have a computer screen right in your face you can play uh, the best games from Battlefield uh, to Borderlands 1, 2, and the pre-sequel, uh, Doom, um, and these are first-person titles, but like I said also, third-person games work fine, as Skyrim has both points of views, uh, but so here we go, uh, first thing you're gonna need is a VR headset, okay, so I got this for really cheap, and I actually pulled up the results on Amazon this exact headset I got which is called the extreme 3d VU or VR VU sorry 3d VR glasses now when you're going off looking for a headset go ahead and look on Amazon type in extreme 3d VU okay VUE I'm gonna pull it up here in a second but I'm just gonna let you guys take a look at that take a look at the headset you know it's uh it's built cheap but it's no Oculus Rift or anything like that when it comes to pricing. Quality? Heh. You know, I honestly I wouldn't be able to tell the difference because the your Oculus, I believe, goes off Samsung phone technology. Um, so I'm using a Samsung Galaxy Note 4, which is pretty much the display they're using. It's a high resolution screen. So basically, your headset here is gonna have an opening. Okay? so there's behind here is where your eyes are gonna go and then here is where your phone is gonna sit and you're gonna close the flap put your phone in there and you're gonna you know have it on like this and, and you'll be gaming for a while but so you need one of these so let me go ahead and pull up you guys might see a little bit of inception here in a second not the movie but um, just like my OBS and stuff so here we go we got the oh we got the extreme cables VR VU virtual reality viewer and that my friends is what you're gonna wanna go for it's uh, 1039 on Amazon there's only three left right now but you could also go for this nicer blue one uh, down here uh, for 30 bucks um, but something cheap like that uh, something fairly cheap you know a couple hours of work and it's all it's all yours it's good to go um, that's pretty much your start okay so from there you're gonna need to do two more things for me okay you're gonna need to I believe on the Google Play Store Android phones only you're gonna have uh, you're gonna search for an app called Trinus um, it's gonna look like this it's called Trinus um, this is what you're gonna want so go ahead and go to google.com uh, Google Trinus T-R-I-N-U-S and you're just gonna go to download you're gonna click that and like I said you, you will need to install the Trinus VR client on your smartphone as well so you're gonna need to do download this twice once on your computer and once on your uh, iPhone or Android device You go over here under download and click the download Trinus VR PC server purple button you can play all your favorite games with the Trinus VR PC server application this connects the phone client and converts any 3D game into VR. So get your free download here. You go to trinusvr.com. Okay. So after that, after that, uh, 
you downloaded it on your PC, you went and got the free version on the Apple Store or the Google Play Store, because they do have two versions of it, Trinus VR and Trinus VR Lite. Go ahead and get the Lite version first. The premium version is going to cost you 10 bucks. So between the headset and the $10 application for the premium version, and all that basically means is that the light version only allows you to play for 20 minutes uh, in a 24-hour period. So go ahead and get that light version first. See if you can crank out all the settings to get it working for you and have the game playable. Um, if you like what you see like I did, uh, then go ahead and upgrade, unlock the premium version, Trinus VR. So let me go grab my phone. I'm going to load up Trinus on my phone, load up Trinus on my PC, we're going to pair the two, and then I'm going to put my phone in the 3D uh, head, head display. So, one second. Alright, so, this is my Galaxy Note 4. This is my Galaxy Note 4, okay? That's a Samsung phone. Um, I believe, well, they do have Trinus VR on the Apple Store. But go ahead, this is what it looks like on the App Store um, for Google Play. Trinus, okay? So go ahead and download that. Uh, once you got it downloaded here, on your phone, you're going to download it on your PC, and now we're going to pair the two. Out of focus, out of focus. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and pair the two. I'm going to show you Skyrim does in fact pop up on my um, phone, and then I'm going to play a little bit and, and show you guys um, what it's all about. So, we're going to take we're gonna shrink me down actually sorry I'm so small but I want to show you guys this there's a little bit of inception there for you headache for everyone headache for everyone okay let me fix my monitor capture here inception Put that right there. Okay, that's good enough. So, okay, here we got the Trinus uh, application loaded up on my PC. I'm going to close it quick um, and go to my start menu, and here it is right here, Trinus, um, right in the middle of my screen. It's one of the only apps I have since I reset my PC a little bit ago. So go ahead and load that up. Go ahead and say yes to the permissions. So now we're entering the Trinus app on our PC. We're going to go ahead on our phone and open the app as well. Okay, so I have the app. A little bit more inception, guys. Sorry about that. I have my app loaded up on my phone. Okay. I have the Trinus app loaded up on the computer and now go ahead and connect your phone to the Wi-Fi if it's not already or you can use a USB cable to do so I'm on Wi-Fi so I'm gonna go ahead and hit this big power button BAM and now I have a dull display here for I have a dull display on my phone. Sorry, I keep messing with OBS. I just want to make sure you guys see this. So here we go. I'm going to fire up the Trinus app on my PC, and it should split into two images. There we go. So it go. It went ahead and split into two images. From here, we are going to load up our Skyrim. I'm sure you guys don't really need to know how to do that on your computer. Now I'm going to wait for it to load. Takes a little bit of 
tinkering with your settings and, and phone size and stuff, but usually takes a little bit, you know, real demanding on the rig. Hope this works, man. There we go, there we go. We got it kicking. Go ahead and start a new game quick. As you can see, Skyrim is in two screens on my phone because one's gonna be for your right eye and your left eye. Hopefully it's in focus. Let's give it a... So here's the character creation screen. We're just gonna go ahead and finish character creation. Call it Trinus Test. Trinus Test. I'm still using my keyboard to type. But as you can see, it's uh, Trinus Test right there. I mean, it's probably out of focus, but... Okay, we're gonna go ahead and choose combat, blah, blah, blah. Sure, sure. Okay, now I'm about to uh, get into the game here. Do we have any weapons? Let me get out of this little town here quick. Inception, bad. Not the most professional tutorial. All right, so let me get out of this cave. So hold on guys, it's coming, it's coming. <laughs> All right, so here we are out in our town and I'm about to snap on the headset and start playing with it. This, well, why don't we do that? Well, I got it here. So right now I'm going to snap this bad boy on. Okay, so I've put my phone in the headset. I'm about to close it shut. If I can, it usually takes some finagling. I think I figured out the secret way to put this in yesterday. Oh, I heard it snap. We're in good, good hands now. Okay. See how my mouse is moving? My hands are up here. It's because it's it's tracking my head. So I'm, my hands are right here. Are you kidding me? Hold on, hold on. Let me turn it down to easy so I can beat you. <laughs> Hopefully I'm... Um, I don't even know if you guys can see me because I can't see anything. 
like in real life. Novice, novice, no. Do I have a weapon? Iron Warhammer. So I'm using my head to look around. There she is. Not using my mouse. Oh, close fight, close fight. <laughs> Chug both of those. Get spanked. Here we have it. Hands are here. Hands are here. Look to the left. Character look to the left. Look to the right. Character look to the right. Look up. Look down. It is awesome, you guys. Seriously. Here, I'll, I'll do it again because I don't know if I was in the frame. Left. Here's my hands. Just so you know, I'm not using a mouse or anything. Left. Right. Up. Down. There is a cave over there, though. That's where we came out of. There's the alchemy now. Uh, alchemy lab. Alchemy lab. And here we'll switch to third person and you can still you can still turn put your weapon away and I could just sit here and look around my character it really is it really is a sick time um, if you enjoyed this tutorial, let me know. If you need any help, I'll be more than happy to help you. Um, I'm going to leave the links in the description for Trinus VR. Um, and go ahead and pick up uh, uh, Skyrim now on Steam, people. Go ahead and get yourself a headset. Buy the premium app of Trinus. Try the light one first. Get it working. But that's all you gotta do. It's so easy and you're not paying $800 for a Oculus Rift headset or anything like that. Hope you guys enjoyed. Till next time, it's Supercoded Dan. Peace.